got M's in the bank, like yes. In the eyebrows, and I'm sorry they look a little wonky, but I didn't use any new product on my brow besides this Elf concealer um, to carve them out. I don't know if today I didn't like using them. I mean, this is a new brush I got. It is a Real Techniques brush. And it's an eyeshadow brush, brush, but gonna use it for this kitchen like it was. Yeah, my mama had to call my name to tell me that we had to come tomorrow. But anyways, back to what I was saying. Using this brush, putting my concealer in. No complaints. Doing what I needed to do. Once again, sorry about my eyebrows looking a little crazy today. Just trying to get some content up and I don't know why you guys want to be playing these games with my eyebrows. <laughs> For real. They play these games with me all the time. And I'm not playing them today. I might need to fill this in right here though. Mm -hmm. By the end of this photo, it'll be fixed because it's gonna bother me. Anyway, I'm gonna take that concealer, dot it on my lids, and I'm going to take that same eyeshadow brush to blend out that concealer. Now, I'll just be going for so long because, like, I really need some mm, inspiration. Like, I need like pictures for y'all to see me or something. So, like, I come on a channel more prepared. I really there's I have favorite eye looks, but like, I feel like that gets repetitive because I haven't got to the point where I'm like reviewing new products that really come out you know I haven't got to that point so it's like my eyeshadow is really repetitive <sighs> anyways I am going to take this NYX earth palette that I got some years ago I'm gonna take this gray shadow right here as weird as that sounds gray eyeshadow But nothing too crazy. Sorry, I just didn't finish cleaning up my eyebrow. I guess I don't know what's going on, y'all. But yeah, and this is a cleavage, cleavage, or manage version. I don't know. But I, it's a brush that I got off Amazon. A white brush that I got off Amazon.
a more precise brush to really get into the crease area. I'm going to use a little bit smaller blending brush. And this is an AOA Studio Brush E128. And once again, I'm going to take that black shadow on that brush. And I'm going to really concentrate that in the crease area. Just like so. I know it looks a little messy right now. Having this little mirror light on, like I have a, a like a mirror with some lights on it. Having that really makes me see my mistakes. I'm not perfect, so whatever. I try to do my videos more right here. Uh, do a close up for you guys so you guys can really see what's going on. I'm gonna take that same blending brush. This little extra product and just go around the edges. Black concealer. Yep. I think it's from this same set, but it just doesn't have the name on it. Strange. I'm gonna take this flat brush and I'm actually going to go into this Wild by Face Candy palette. I'm 
gonna go into this shade called Storm. It's a very nice blue brush. Now I'm going to put that where we put it. That's only one dip, guys. Okay, we one dip. So I'm going to the other side. And I'm gonna think my brush packed it up. So I'm gonna do the same thing. I brought this one out a little bit more than the other side. That's okay. Now I'm gonna take makeup light. Maybe. And I don't really have fallout. Honestly intended to make this like an everyday look, but I've done like probably three videos on like eyeshadows you can use for an everyday look. So um yeah. Gonna come with some color. So always clean your face. Keep forgetting the fun. <sighs> Actually I did some moisturize before this video. Why did I just do that? This is like not my perfect shade, but I can finesse it enough to where it looks pretty, pretty good. So I gotta be careful not to put too much, cause then if I like cake it on, then that's when it starts to look like two different colors. I used to do my makeup with a brush just like 
like this one, I'll just tap it in. Alright, we're gonna take a bunch. This is a simple bag though, like my nose, I have like a dark spot on my nose and it doesn't 100% cover up the dark spot. I mean, you gotta look close at any of this to see it, but I know it's there. I can see it. Just an FYI. See, like all this, I don't know if y'all can see, but <sighs> I can still see my dark spots. Jesus, I'm gonna go around my eyebrows to make sure. Can't see like white cast. Shoot. I'm going to go in. Let me grab it. 
my vanity is like see through. So it's glass like on the top and then so you can see what's in the middle. That makes sense. So I can this is what I'm doing. Brush, I think I got it in like this perfusion contour palette that I have. It's just like contour and like highlight in there. I think I got it out of there. <laughs> yeah, there's nothing wrong with it. I use a brush personally to um, uh, do my foundation. It's just easier when it comes to like blending in the powder and stuff. I can really concentrate that powder. I mean, I apply the powder with the smudge, but it's easier for me to like help it blend in and stuff. But I'll just take the back of the sponge and I'm gonna try to tap that in as much as I can. I feel like I'm gonna end up not being satisfied with my makeup today. But it's okay. I'm going to bed anyways. taking my time today you know it looks like I'm rushing but I don't know usually I talk more but I feel like I'm not talking as much here we go some more color and now for blush I'm gonna go back into which color is it? Is this one? No, the other one. I think. Alrighty. Yep. I'm going to blush, and now I'm going to choose this eyeshadow right here. I'm gonna use Real Technique Brush. Really pigmented, so I'm gonna tap it off and smile. I should have used the other blush that I normally use, but it's okay. Been so into my Morphe palettes and stuff. I don't even think I've, you know, used my other palettes. I have other palettes, y'all. Promise. I have several palettes. I'm gonna show y'all my collection one day. One of these videos. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna set my face in a second. My lip 
trips lately, I have been. First off, for a shirt. Because I can't find the first one I needed to learn. I've been using this a um, powder down here. I think it's an eyebrow powder. Never used it really. And I just go along the way. Sometimes I'll add a gloss on top, which is my Fenty Beauty Primer Milk Gloss. I'll tap that on my fingers. I'll tap the gloss in. Right in the middle. Just like that. I'm going to set my face. I guess I'm not doing liner today. Whatever. Love, love, love. And I'm just going to. I'm not putting on lash either. So, yeah, I need to buy some new lashes. I did, but there's still a mail that will come into like next week or something. And I ordered them like in January. <laughs> Fun. ordered these lashes off at Aliexpress because they were coming from China and well around the time that I ordered them they were having their a um Chinese New Year so they emailed me and told me that that's why it took so long they were doing the Chinese New Year celebration and they were so I couldn't even cancel the order because they have to approve the cancel this. Anyway, this is my face. Very bright, very crusty. Smiling mirror, which why try to get some content out for you guys. And that's what I do. I'm standing on my baby chair, but thank you guys for tuning into today's video. I know it's a little bit long. Sorry, but. If you watched the whole video, thank you so much for my favorite. But yeah, so I'll see you guys in my next video and I'll try to make it not so long. I can't make any promises because we don't have that one last time. So see you guys later. Thanks.